installed the system in 208, uh, before we had the system, we had oil. Mm -hmm. And and, and I, there was a couple of reasons why we wanted to go to geothermal. With the oil, the prices fluctuated, started somewhere at $70 and went up to $150 in, in like a couple of years. So in terms of heating costs, uh, it was ridiculous. You know, one year it might be... Uh, Three hundred dollars to fill a tank, and then and then the next uh, winter was six hundred dollars. So in addition to the just the environmental sure, differences right. too. I mean that was a main driving factor behind our decision. Yeah. In addition to the cost, I mean, yeah. There's a huge savings. There's a huge cost savings, but there's it's the benefit ultimately is to ourselves and to the environment. Yeah, it's right? nice. It's nice to know that you're heating the house without destroying the environment. Yeah, right. I mean, absolutely. people always sometimes say, "Well, what can we do?" Well, this is one real matter of fact thing you can do to improve the environment is to have a geothermal unit. And it's something we use every day, obviously. I mean, with, since it has the cooling in the summer, which uh, you know, the, it's the last few summers since we've had this have been extremely warm. So we we didn't have it previously, so it's a great bonus to have that as well as the heating side. <laughs> so that was that was you know. Those two main reasons, the cost and the environmental um, uh, aspect was why we went to geothermal. Yeah, and it was surprisingly quick. The actual install was when uh, John Bosman and his yeah. team came. <laughs> They're surprisingly quick. I think it took about two days to do the yeah. entire dig of our backyard. And, you know, they're extremely careful. We have a lot of, uh, we have a lot of uh, mature trees. Everything was, uh, I mean, they're still alive and well today, so they were, they were very careful that way, and they are very quick um, doing the work that they needed to do. And they are very good about the fact that we have a couple of very young children, so with the work that had to be done inside the house, um, yeah. they are very, you know, tried to work around some nap schedules when that was necessary, yeah. and, and just were quick and very professional, yeah. and we really appreciate it. Um, you don't need a pond to tap into or a water source to tap into for the geothermal. Um, there's two methods. You can have a, a horizontal system, like for us. Which our, is what we have. Which we have, and our backyard is smaller, so they just double decorated it. They dug deeper, put one layer, and then the next. So they, they maximize the space. Or you can have a vertical, which you to can drill straight down. Straight down. You know, you'd spend twenty to thirty thousand dollars on a car, which has absolutely no return on your investment. Whereas this is something that increases the value of our house. It increases the uh, um, the. I mean, it's better for the environment. It's it's more cost effective for us in terms of heating and cooling. I mean, we didn't have an air conditioning set um, in our house before this, so it's a great bonus to have that. Is in addition to the heating elements as well. The, the unit itself is actually. Um smaller than our uh, oil furnace was. So um, it, it's not intrusive in the basement or anything like that. It's just, uh, it, it's actually given us more space. Another nice advantage, and in, in, uh, the Boss Tech guys offered this to us, is that we have a pre, we have natural gas water tank, but we've got a preheating tank through the geothermal. So they run the piping and whatnot uh, the, the water tank so we're actually saving money on on our water heating bills through the the geothermal so it heats our place cools our place and it also saves us money on the water tank because we've got the preheat tank so that was just something extra that they threw in and the cost was absolutely minimal and we said okay so once again a nice advantage